Hi, everybody. It's Katie from Octane AI. We're so excited to be a part of ReAmaze's BFCM campaign. Just to give you a little bit of background, Octane AI is an all-in-one platform for quizzes, Facebook Messenger, and SMS marketing for Shopify brands. What we're going to cover today is a little bit about what's been happening with e-commerce, but also how we can provide a better customer journey for online shoppers with quizzes and different remarketing strategies. So what's been going on since the pandemic hit? Online spending has increased incredibly, and this shift is permanent. What hasn't changed, though, is the online experience. So let's zoom out a little bit and look at what happens in store. So in store, somebody comes in, they're looking for a product, they have a specific need or concern, and what happens next? A sales associate talks to them. So a sales associate gets to figure out what's this person looking for and what product should they buy. It then makes that decision on the sales associate instead of putting that decision burden onto the customer. What's happening at the moment is customers are sorting through product catalogs and collections and trying to figure out what product meets their need based on the product photo and the description, which can be really overwhelming. It can be like they're almost walking through a warehouse just trying to figure out where to navigate without sh someone showing them how. So what we've done is we've actually reimagined the customer journey. So in the blue is what the customer is experiencing with a quiz. And in the yellow is what's happening in the back end. So in the blue, a customer is referred by a friend or comes from an ad, they visit the website. They engage with the shop quiz, which gives them a personalized product recommendation. Then, easy as pie, they make their first purchase. Um, they can then be sent a post-purchase shop quiz, and then they can continue to make a repeat purchase. But what's happening in the background is you're collecting buyer profiles. So you're figuring out based on the questions that you're asking within the quiz, what is this customer's need, preference, concern? Do they have dry skin? Have they never worn eyelashes before? Are they eyelash fanatics and they know everything about eyelashes? Um, do they have coarse hair? Do they have thin hair? What are their concerns? Do they like pink? Do they like green? Um, you can ask any question that you would possibly want to know about your customers and then use that to create buyer personas. What you then do with these buyer personas is you can help create remarketing, messenger, SMS, email, um, target ads that's using this data, or run different campaigns to help people. If they've never used your product category before, running an educational campaign with different ads or email flows can be really effective. And so the buyer profile, it is the sum of the buying information that you have on each customer. So here are some really great examples. Um, Skinny Mixes has an amazing quiz where you can answer a number of different questions, what flavors you like, what flavors you don't like, and they'll take you to a recipe that you can actually make. Dough Lashes has a really great quiz as well. They're asking you questions about you know, what's your eye shape? What does your eye look like? How long are your lashes? Do you wear lashes often? And that's helping them figure out the next step for them. So when you're identifying the customer's buyer profile, you can then match them with the right product. You're collecting all this data with these crazy insights like conversion rate, average order value, and finding out who your buyers actually are. And then you're leveraging that data with email, SMS, messenger, triggered flows, um, running Facebook ads, sending sponsored messages, and then understanding the deeper analytics. And then you'll lead someone to place an order. When somebody knows what product is right for them, they're more likely to press place order and make a purchase. Awesome, thank you so much. Hope you have a great BFCM.